In this video I'm going to show you how you can easily add another account in WhatsApp on an iPhone. Be sure to watch the video to the very end so you don't make any mistakes. Let's get started guys and first off open up WhatsApp. As you can see I have already signed into my account and then first off we need to head over to settings, then tap at chats and then chat backup. First of all guys we need to make a backup by tapping add backup now. It will start backing up process just need for it until it's done and then after a while when the backup is done and it says here that last backup was today we need to close WhatsApp app for now and then head over to settings. I'm gonna show you from the beginning, so first off you need to open up settings, then get into general, and then iPhone storage. Once the page is loaded, enter WhatsApp, and here we need to tap at delete app, and then delete app again to confirm it. After that, you need to install WhatsApp app again. To do that, we need to head over to the App Store, then search for WhatsApp in that way, then hit Get, then double click to install the app. It will require to use your Face ID to confirm your identity and then it will start downloading WhatsApp on your iPhone. Now we can go out of App Store and uh, right here we can already find WhatsApp app icon. It says loading here, so we just need for it to complete. Actually guys, we need to remove the WhatsApp app first because this is the only way to sign out from our old account. And then when the app is downloaded, we can open it up select VLAN and cellular or VLAN only or don't allow depends on which option you prefer to use however the app need to use internet so you have to choose one of these two options I'm gonna select the first one then I'm gonna tap at agree and continue and on that step we need to enter our phone number. That's where you need to enter a phone number of your account in which you want to sign in. Here we can change the country. I'm going to enter Russia here. And then I will enter my phone number. That's actually the same phone number that I used before. However, you can enter any phone number here. Then hit next. It may send you confirmation code that you'll need to enter on the next step to confirm that you are actually have access to that phone number. However, I've been taken to the step where I can restore my chat history. I can just hit right here and wait until the chat history is restored. Then I can hit next. Then we can enter a name for our account. Hit done. And then if we would like to give WhatsApp app access to our contacts, we can allow it. Basically guys, that's how you can easily use another account in WhatsApp on an iPhone. And if this video was helpful for you, don't forget to hit the like button.